Ned Beatty, who had memorable roles in classic dramas Network, Nashville, Deliverance, and 1978's Superman, has died. The legendary character actor was 83. Beatty died early Sunday, in his Los Angeles home, surrounded by his family and loved ones, his manager Deborah Miller said in a statement to USA Today. Beatty's family decided to keep further details of his death private at this time, according to the statement. Ned is an iconic, legendary talent, as well as a dear friend, and he will be missed by us all, the statement read. The Kentucky native broke into movies playing the genial vacationer Bobby Tripp, brutally raped by a backwoodsman in 1972's Deliverance, starring Burt Reynolds and John Voight. The scene in which Tripp is brutalized became the most memorable in the movie, establishing Beatty as an actor whose name moviegoers may not have known but whose face they always recognized. For people like me, there's a lot of, I know you. I know you. What have I seen you in? Beatty remarked to the Associated Press in 1992. Beatty starred as corporate executive Arthur Jensen in 1976's Network, receiving his one Oscar nomination for the role that featured the immortal money speech to Howard Beale, Peter Finch. You have meddled with the primal forces of nature, and you will atone. In 1978, Beatty flipped the script to star in one of the most memorable roles of his career as the bumbling henchman Otis, alongside Gene Hackman's villain Lex Luthor, in Superman. Beatty also appeared in the 1980 sequel, Superman II. In 1993's Rudy, Beatty starred as Daniel Ruettiger, the proud working-class father of Notre Dame football walk in Rudy Ruettiger. Other film roles included All the President's Men, The Front Page, Nashville, and The Big Easy. In 2010's Toy Story 3, Beatty voiced the sinister bear Lotso, who ruled the cast off toys of Sunnyside Daycare, a role that earned an MTV Movies Award nomination for Best Villain. Thanks, Ned, for bringing Lotso to life, both his good side and his not-so-good side. We'll miss you, director Lee Unkrich tweeted Sunday. The next year Beatty voiced Tortoise John, the mayor of a western town called Dirt, in the animated movie, Rango, in a 1977 interview, he explained why he preferred being a supporting actor. Stars never want to throw the audience a curveball, but my great joy is throwing curveballs, Beatty told App. Being a star cuts down on your effectiveness as an actor because you become an identifiable part of a product and somewhat predictable. You have to mind your P's and Q's and nurture your fans. But I like to surprise the audience, to do the unexpected. On television, Beatty was at his best as debt. Stanley, the big man, Bolander on NBC's, Homicide, Life on the Street, and for recurring roles in, Roseanne, as John Goodman's father. Beatty was born in Louisville in 1937. He married Sandra Johnson in 1999 and had eight children from three previous marriages.